All right, folks. So today we got the Rowan wireless guitar system, guitar bass instrument system, whatever you want to call it. Comes in a box like so, which is great for um, taking your gig and stuff as well. Just fits in there like that. And you got your USB cable over here. It's like a little USB cable with two outlets, one for each system part. Um, comes with a little instruction manual, which basically explains everything. Basically, um, you can have six different wireless systems going of these. Um, probably more than you'll ever use, but different channels and stuff like this. And once it's paired to it, the pairing was a little weird. I just kind of kept hitting the buttons and stuff until it was paired. Um, but as you can see, these little blue lights here indicate the battery charge. This one has a little more juice. Um, so you can see that. I've been playing with these for an hours, or for hours, for a few hours. Um, and that's all that went down. I didn't even charge them. This is right out of the box when I got them. So obviously you can see the batteries last pretty well. Um, construction, it is plastic. Um, and you get like a pretty much that kind of angle. And let's just check this out. Actually, receive, we get the transmitter and receiver. So we'll put the receiver in the amp. There you go. Um, Strat style body guitar. You're gonna have, you can either leave it like that. It's upside down, but you can leave it either way. Like that. It might move around a bit, but that's all you can get out of that. That's if you don't drop it, <laughs> but that's the strat style. Um, <sighs> tell the deluxe or anything that's kind of sideways, or sideways, on the side, jack, and you kind of got it like that. Um, it does move around a little bit, so. You can leave it like that, or tuck it under. But it does, if you tuck it under, it kind of sticks out like that, so do it like that. Maybe, uh, I would just leave it like that. Then it looks kind of crazy, but. And then, got like a Jaguar here, or let's see, I guess any of the, a lot of basses and stuff, Jag bass, P bass. Kind of a top loader as well. Um, like so. Hmm. Oh, it's gonna plug it in, right? So, um, really cool. Um, actually kind of goes with the Jag, nice. The, the, the colors and everything with the pick guard and the white, anyways. Um, so let's talk about range. Um, I can walk all. Um, I guess that's, uh, I can walk around my whole apartment pretty much and out in the hallway. There you go. It's kind of weird how when you move the amp gets noisier and doesn't. But that's cool too. Cause it... I like doing that, finding my sweet spot. Um, 
for recording. I use wireless for recording too, it's pretty cool. Um, so overall, I mean, like I said, it is made of plastic, but despite being made of plastic, it's actually pretty durable. Um, I haven't uh, used it live yet, but I'm sure it will be fine. Another cool feature has an auxiliary in, so you can plug an auxiliary into here, and then you have a headphone jack on there as well. So if if you want to use it as a wireless, I guess a system speaker system or something as well, it'd be cool. Um, so really cool. Um, there you go. Still got a lot of charge left on it. And that's just a quick overview. It's really cool, it works awesome. The battery has been uh, excellent so far. And like I said, it comes with a cable. Where's the cable at? USB cable here with the double ends. It's about roughly four feet long, which doesn't really matter, but just plug it in there to recharge, and then you're good to go. All right, that's all for now. Check one out. I recommend them. Pretty cool. And I'll talk to you soon.